I think we can all agree that sometimes emotion gets the better of us, and that was no exception during the quarterfinals of the Champions League between Liverpool and Real Madrid when this happened. <laughs> The wondrous world of clickbait thumbnails, more specifically football clickbait thumbnails. Be rid the days of Picasso, Da Vinci, because now we have MNX HD and many more. Today I've amassed all the best thumbnails I could have gotten into one PowerPoint, grouped them all together into different categories, and we're gonna just appreciate this beautiful art form. First, we have the thumbnails that go along with these kinds of titles, like, OH MY GOD, MOST DISRESPECTFUL MOMENTS IN FOOTBALL, or, you know, that kind of stuff. See, there's a beautiful perception to these types of thumbnails. For example, the first one I'm looking at right now, where Bruno is flipping someone off. Who is he flipping off? We don't know, but through this true art form, where there's a split between him and Jao Felix, you could maybe perceive that he's actually flipping off Jao Felix. We don't know, we don't know, but that's the beauty of clickbait football thumbnails. Then you got the more direct stuff where Ronaldo is saying something to a player like shut up Florenzi you little midget <laughs> then he got other ones like Zidane kicking Messi or uh, you know uh, Lucas Vasquez talking to Luka Modric saying give me damn ball Croatian sh next up in the football clickbait thumbnails would be the crazy weather you got the great flood of 1916 maybe that scene from that Korean film where the tsunami submerges an entire city just your normal day in Wisconsin and finally Kansas. For some reason, these thumbnails also take inspiration from, uh, Zeus. Next up is probably one of my favorites, the impossible goal. I love these ones because they just show this trajectory of the ball where it just defies all the laws of physics. My favorite one, though, has to be when it's just a normal penalty, but the ball's trajectory is a damn loop-de-loop -loop into the net. Then we have, like, some subcategories, like the penalty, where either you have keeper just giving up on life, Keeper being dumb, or nine players in goal. <laughs> the fights. I can't lie, some of these look very ultra realistic, so I'm not even sure if I can show it on the video. I don't know if you guys remember when Pepe and Ronaldo went at it and then Pepe had enough and just kicked Ronaldo in the face, or remember that time when Zlatan did the same thing? Or maybe you recall that time when Neymar did a fatality on one of the Liga defenders. Or surely you remember this time when 2013 Neymar broke the time-space continuum and met Ronaldo in 2020. Our next category is... I don't even know if this video can be monetized with shit like this. It, it's so odd what goes to these guys' heads to make these. And these have titles like, When Fans Go Too Wild, or Go Too Far, or some shit like that. I love them. <laughs> I love them. We have the Weirdly Gruesome. I might have to cut out some stuff because the video might be demonetized, but we'll see. We have Hung Min Son doing the Liu Kang to N'Golo Conte. Then we have Neymar, who just got shot in the foot as you do in a football match. And then we have Messi. Messi's been discombobulated before our eyes. That's got a massive fucking gash across his knee. He's got ketchup on his forehead and his arm. And then his leg is just fucking twisted the other way. These are by far the worst ones though. I would like to simply call this the horny. First, you have the stripper. It's always the same Vitali HD stripper. You have Mbappe next to the stripper with the title Mo most beautiful and respect moments in sports. This one I'd like to call the caught lacking. Then I found this really, really odd sh I don't know what it is. I, I feel bad for literally every single female referee to ever exist now that I've seen some of these thumbnails. Because, oh man. Oh man. Th this one more specifically is... <laughs> I can't, I just... I think one of my favorites, though, has to be just this random picture of a female referee. Ronaldo's doing his little celebration. The thumbnail just- <laughs> The thumbnail just circles her chest. That's not even, like, the first time I've seen that. Here's another one where the title is, When the referee is a hot girl. Don't miss this video. We have Zidane, you know, I- I don't know if that's the original picture or not. I'm assuming it's probably not. But we got Zidane over here, slapping the fucking dump truck of Eden Hazard. And then, of course, you know, you had to have your edits, like, Pirlo with Ronaldo and then <laughs> female referee. And then to end off the horny, we have the downright odd. Neymar just, you know, as he does, flirting with women on the sidelines. I like the title for this one because it's when ball boy slash girl get bored. <laughs> this one I don't even know what to label. We have uh, Romelu Lukaku 
on fire. I'm sure you recall that one time during an Arsenal-Chelsea match when it had to be postponed because the entire goal just decided to collapse. And then finally we have this one, which uh, I... I don't even know what's going on, so if you want to create some kind of conspiracy theory in the comments, go ahead. Be my guest. Alright, so this one's just labeled, Hot Pick of Mo Salah. Say less. <laughs> I've had my fun looking at thumbnails. It's time to create them. I'll even set a challenge for the audience. If you think you can make a better football clickbait thumbnail than me, go into my Discord and send your submissions. If I get enough submissions, maybe I do my own review on all of them. We'll see. Okay, so before we go into this thumbnail creating stuff, I, I came across this on Twitter, and I, I just need to listen to it real quick, okay? So just, just give me a second. This is the new Charlotte FC fan-made anthem or something. Uh... Let's hear it. I know why I'm here. Welcome to the club. Charlotte FC. Carolina, you're here. Let's go. Bow, bow. We here to win. We not here to lose. Now that I am significantly more depressed than I was before, I guess we can now start this. We have our canvas. It is now time to create a work of art. First off, the impossible crazy goal. So here we have our image, 23 meters out. It is Lionel Messi on the free kick. He knows this is going in. I know this is going in. Everyone knows it's going in. But how's it gonna go in? It's gonna take like a normal trail, right? Got a nice little curve to it. But then all of a sudden, it just flies all the way up like a little rocket ship. And then soon it's into space, right? And it actually starts to orbit the moon. Not once, not twice. But I, I think that was three. I, I don't know. So once it goes back down, it's not just going to simply, you know, just go into the net. <laughs> what are you, stupid? It's going to find this little divot in the pitch here. So once it goes into the ground, it's like, wh where do you think it's going to go? I, I don't know, man. I don't know. You know, football itself is a very inspirational sport. I think people can kind of look at it and say, oh yeah, you know, this may be impossible, but surely it will become possible very soon. And that's kind of my take on this little free kick here. Bravo. You've done it again, Maxwell. You've done it again. Oh man, I should get paid for this. This is beyond my wildest of dreams.